Yes, guys, how you doing? Welcome back to the Spurs Talk Show. We're here today. I'm going to come down to a little bit of a lower level. We've got Jack, Albert, Billy and Henry. All youngsters from the Tottenham community. How are you guys doing? How are you feeling after the game? Good. 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 Buzzing. Buzzing. Great performance. Well, I'm, going to start, I'm going to start with you, my man. Yeah. I'm going to come across. the. Uh, what was your thoughts on the game? Were you going into it? How were you feeling about it? Were, were, you, were you excited? It was always going to be a tough match, but when, we, when, we got, when they got two red cards, I think then we started to attack them but I feel like they just sat in and it was always going to like the goal was going to come in the end how much more time do you think we needed <laughs> we got it, it was like the last, the last 10 seconds of the game yeah, so. no, but yeah brilliant brilliant performance and just keep going keep going good, good start I want to ask you before I come down um, in terms of team selection Richarlison got his he got his place back in the first team today what were your thoughts on him well I thought he, he did alright he, he had an alright game but I thought he was going to play up front and Son on the left. I think Son up front was good, but when Richarlison was getting on the ball, good good stuff made from him, yeah. And good assist for Son's goal. Absolutely, 100%. My man, I'm going to come down to you. I hope, this, I hope we can squeeze in. Um, what were your thoughts on the game? When, we, when, the, when the first red card happened, did you see the replay? Did you think it was a red card? Uh, I thought it was a red card. I mean, I never thought it was going to be 2-1. Um, I was shocked at the last second's goal and I just think we're going to win the league. That was the question I was going to ask you. We're unbeaten, we played seven games, we played Manchester United, Arsenal and now Liverpool. We've come through them all. Are Tottenham in a title race? Yeah. 100%? Yes. Yes. Well, who's the next game? Who, who are we going to lose to this season? No one. We're invincibles. You think so as well? Yes, yes. <laughs> you all think so? Yeah, yeah I think we're invincible. Invincible season? Yeah. Yep. If you had to pick one player from the Tottenham team today, boys, I'll start with you, my man. Um, who was the man of the match for you? Man of the match for me, I would say I would say Son. I think he had a good game, a good chances. I don't know why he keeps taking them off, but I think he had a really good game. Well, I think I've heard that Sonny might be picking up an injury. or like He's not injured, but like he's got a knock. He's trying to... You know, Andrew's trying to protect him a little bit, make sure he's fit for the next game. He has scored the second most goals in the Premier League this season behind Erling Haaland. But the stats say he is the best striker, the best number nine in the Premier League. Do you agree? Um, uh, maybe not the best number nine because it's not <laughs> his natural position. But I think he's definitely up there as one of the best. Manor Solomon came on on the left-hand side today. What's your thoughts on Manor Solomon? I think he's an all-right player. Technically, I think he's good. But... He can whip the ball in and stuff. But I think he's a good player. I think a very good player. And Basuma, I've got to ask you, Basuma today absolutely handled it. It's like the seventh game on the spin. Basuma's the best defensive midfielder in the league. Do you agree? Yeah, I do agree. He's really um, good at defending and attacking and good at switching the balls. Fantastic. And what about Pape Sar? The man's 19 years old. To you guys, that's very young. To people like me, that's very, very... Sorry, to people like you, it's very old. To people like me, that's very, very young. But he feels like an absolute champion in the midfield as well, right? He? he bosses it, and he bosses it against all the teams, and he's really good. Let me ask you a question about the centre-backs. Oh. Christian Romero and Mickey van der Ven. Which one of those two is your favourite right now? I'll come back to you, Mike. Van der Ven. He's just... He's got everything. He wants to defend. Um, I think he can play the ball. I think he can pass the ball. I think he can, if he needs to put one, something on someone, he can put it on them. Um, I think his awareness is brilliant, and I think him and Romero's partnership really good. Yeah. Best centre back partnership in the league. Up there, up there, up there. one of the best. Yes. What about Destiny you doggy, my man? Des is he the best left back in the league right now? Yes. Yeah. He's getting stuck into all of the tackles. He's rapid and he's just the best. And last question for you guys, Ange Postacoglu. Did, were you guys, when we first were signing him, when we first got him on board, were you guys happy we heard about or Had you heard of him? Were you happy we signed him? I was uh, happy. I was happy that we signed him. I didn't think he'd be doing this well with us, but he's really brought Tottenham together as a team. And we're actually playing good football now. Good enough football to win the league? Maybe, yeah. <laughs> if it's not going to be Tottenham, who's going to win the league? Say. City. City. Well, they, so City lost today to Wolves. We've got to play Wolves in the next four, three or four games, guys, right? Is that the team of the next four games? We've got Fulham, Luton, Wolves and Crystal Palace. One of those teams, are any of those teams going to beat us? I think 
Luton away will be a hard one just at their ground. Like they'll keep it, they'll just be holding in and then maybe it'll be hard to break us down like today. Um, but I think then no Premier League game's easy, but we're playing good football and we keep it up, then we're going in the right direction. Absolutely fantastic. Guys, you guys have been absolutely sensational. I just need one more giant shout into the camera. Come on, you Spurs on three. One, two, three. Come on, Spurs! There you go. Fantastic, fantastic. Thank you. Thank you.